But one is doing the right thing though. Yeah. Yes. Yes. But you won't know. No, nobody yeah. say another the right thing sis. No, the way you are sounding looks like I'm doing something wrong. No, that's not what I'm doing. Yes. So you yes. guys you you guys are going to be see. fed up. Yes, yes, to your neck, to your throat. Yes. <laughs> so guys, the next so the next question is what do you love most about being twins? I love the attention. I love the fact that we look alike. Um, it's been a long time since I, ex I experienced the things really went to Ghana and I was in Nigeria. I just go to places on my own. People don't really like, if it's before people be like, wow, why are you guys doing this? Why are you guys look alike? You're so beautiful. But since we came back, even when we are going to the market, going anywhere, and we see we are, we are on the same hairstyle, people be like, are you guys doing You look beautiful, and so on and so forth. So I like the attention. And I like the fact that there is someone you can confide in. There are a lot of people you can't confide in. Most of your friends, most of your friends, you agree with me, you can't confide in most of them because you can't trust them. So I'm happy I have someone to share my problems, share anything about life with. And I know that it is it's safe with that person. Yeah. So guys, what I love about being a twin is the fact that I have my person. I have my personal person that... If I tell her this thing, it's not going anywhere. In case you don't know, I don't have friends. I don't keep friends. I can be going through a lot, but I don't tell people what I go through. That's because I don't trust people like that. But my, I'm, I'm so grateful to God for giving me someone that is my person. That no matter what, if I tell her this thing, I know that it's not going anywhere. Nobody else will hear it because she does not gossip. Yeah, so I love the fact that I have a twin, someone that is my blood, my flesh and blood. I have other siblings, I have other sisters, but our bond is so different yeah, from just being a sister. Different. So it's that's true. what I love about being a twin. The fact that I have my person, my personal person. Yes, guys. So the next question is: Have you ever tricked anyone to be the other person? I, I don't think so, guys. I don't. Okay, maybe when much when much um, earlier when we were younger. Um, I don't remember any self. I don't think so. Is there any any day we trick uh, people? She has forgotten. Remember we were little. We used to trick. We used to trick my mom sometimes. She'll be looking for the other person. Maybe and the other person has gone to play or see her friend and will be like, okay, it's it's Jennifer. Jennifer can be like, it's Judith. But my mother used to know the difference. So the truth is, that even if we trick her, she's not the truth. So then we used to try to trick my mother, but my mother she will always find out. Uh, this is not this, this is genuine. Forget that we look alike, guys. There's we have different. some difference. We don't know. Yes. We just don't want you to know. know. Yes. But we have that there is a there's something we can we can use to differentiate us. Yes. 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 Who is more likely to cause trouble? Hmm. Huh. <laughs> guys, can you imagine? Is Judy troublesome? Is Judy troublesome? You guys you should are, say. You know. I'm not. I, I won't say I'm troublesome, but don't try me. I don't look for me. I'm very quiet, I'm very calm, I'm very peaceful, but when you can't, when you push me to the wall, that's when you see me react. That's true. But yes, I'm more likely to cause trouble. That's true. So the next question is, um, who does it, how does it feel like being apart now? Hmm. Because you know we've been apart for a while now, I think, is it a year? Two years, almost two years. Two years, so it's I, like, just like I told you, I miss being around someone that I know, you just have to, that person is really far that you just have to maybe um, call the person um, and video call the person it. and so it's, it's, it was, it was really hard, I just had to like get used to it that um, she's not always going to be here with me, yes, so it, it wasn't easy I would say, yes, while she wasn't here with me, you know she was in Ghana while I was in Nigeria, it wasn't easy, easy because I couldn't, see, I couldn't see that person that I could relate to, like life, like personally. Eh? If if I want to talk to her, I have to like call her, video call her to say this is what is going on, this is what is going on. So and even working alone most of the time, you know when you are friends, you tend to be together all the time. So making friends and like oh, no, yes, yes. So I'm really happy that my best friend is here with me. Yes. So I would say it wasn't easy. So besties, the next question is Did your twin sister think that is it do do your twin sister think ever think that the bond you share will be cultured after marriage? Hmm. Never. The bond we share can never be cut off by any marriage or not. Nothing can cut the bond we share. Yeah. 
as for me it's the same thing nothing can cut the bond with here because there is even if i'm far away in that country there is video call there is whatsapp call you there is there is yes there are so many things you can use i can reach <coughs> use excuse me i can use to always reach her so it can never be cut short so guys the next question is do you do your kids have a hard time distinguishing between you and your twin sister by the way guys i don't have a kid yet but she has a daughter called and sophia and, and she's, she's my daughter too yes so um <coughs> i would say when sophia was much 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 younger when she was still small like really really small she was a baby she couldn't distinguish between me and her mom she used to think i'm her mom sometimes so i would say but now ah she knows she knows the difference she knows the difference she knows even the way we treat like the way we treat her most of the time she'll be like you're the best auntie ever <laughs> so she knows the difference between us she knows her auntie her best auntie and she knows her mom yes mm -hmm. yeah, so it's the same thing she knows i'm her mom but when she was much younger she didn't know our difference so right now she knows the difference so guys the next question is do you guys fall ill the same time yes guys i'll say yes because yes, especially when we we're growing up yes when we we're younger we used to fall ill the same time but because we don't stay in the same country now Anymore, sometimes yes, it's hard to no. know when she, except i call her and she says she's sick and she's my sister is this kind of person that don't accept that she's sick even if she's sick she will not accept she's sick yeah so i hardly even know when she's sick right now yeah it was when i was around her i used to know when she's ill when she's not ill because i was living we we're living together but right now sometimes i don't know when she's sick it's me that sometimes when i'm ill i used to say it out but i yeah. used to say that sometimes but yeah. not every time, every time. Though, because i feel um I'll, I'll, I'll be okay what or what you believe is what will become yeah and i'll be okay so the next question is who is more secretive hmm. me <laughs> <coughs> i'm more secretive that i know yeah i am yes I and am. i am unapologetic about that yes. yes i'm not secretive i don't know how to hide anything me judith if i'm doing something you know if something is up up in my life you know i don't i don't know how to be secretive i don't know how to hide anything down to who i was dating right from when i started dating in the university or when I, before i got into the university after secondary school everybody knew that person there's i don't know i'm not secretive about my relationship i'm not secretive about anything i can't hide anything as a person if i'm doing something if i'm somewhere you know but my twin you will never know so she's very secretive but i'm always doing the right thing though yeah yes yes but you won't know no nobody yeah. say i'm not doing the right thing sis. no the way you are sounding looks like i'm doing something wrong no that's not what about. i mean no, no. i what just I mean, guys i just those of you who <coughs> understand what i'm saying it's a good secretive who understand i'm a very it. secretive person i believe sometimes people shouldn't know about things in the open till like it has i don't know till maybe you have accomplished that thing you want to do there's no need for other people to know about it so like i don't when think she that's was a in the university though. she didn't post one single picture on social media till she graduated that's hmm. to tell you how secretive she is <laughs> meanwhile when <laughs> oh i was in God. high institution people used to know i think i'm i'm not a secretive i used to post person. picture but picture about my school Sin like you, i'm in this school, school i am doing this she was in a very good school but no. you will never know so that's yes, i just how, think there's no need for that yeah so yes. she's very secretive i'm, I'm not secretive in anything. i cannot hide no matter how i even try to hide it eh, you must find out so i'm not secretive so do you wear same outfits mm, i would say that was before when we were really like teenagers back then when we were children teenagers yes we used to my mom used to pair us up with clothes that look and like they are the same so we used to wear same outfit same kind of outfit before but now since we are far away we can't just buy things that look alike i'm here in nigeria what i see what i like is what i buy she's in ghana what she sees what she likes what but she this buys. period so, we are going to be yes we are going to be twinning a, twin a lot yes so you guys yes, you guys are going to be see. fed up yes, yes to your neck to your throat yes. <laughs> so the next oh question is who is the outspoken one mm. <laughs> I'm not outspoken. She is. I'm trying, but she is. She doesn't need to try. <laughs> it's just in me to. I I I tend to talk too much than her. So if that's what you mean by outspoken, yes, I'm more outspoken than she is. She is more reserved. I don't talk plenty. Yes. So, who is more friendly? Friendly. <laughs> we are. We are both friendly. I would say. 
I'm friendly. I know I'm friendly. I don't have like a lot of friends, but I can just see and say hi, hello. That's it. We are both friendly in our way, but people can say we are not friendly though. But I'm still. It's the same. <laughs> Sophia, allow me say something. Now. Yes, guys, we are both friendly, but I'm more friendly than she is. I tend to like make friends. If I'm in an environment, mm. but I can make friends with people faster than she can. But people might think I am not friendly too because I'm not that 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 friendly. But I am more friendly than she is. Do you understand? We almost come to the end of this video. So the last question is: When was the last time you had a fight? Hmm. As I can't remember. We don't fight like exchanging blows and the rest, but we argue a lot. I would say. Yes. Yeah, we don't fight, we just argue, we just correct ourselves, we tell ourselves the truth. And it's normal. Yeah, and it's normal. Our opinions differ. So. Yeah, so we tend to argue a lot, not fighting. We argue very well, yes, we argue a lot, but we still settle because we are sisters. At the end of the day, we still wake up the same in, in the morning and greet and be like, Madam, how far now? Then this one will say, I'm fine. So that's how it is. We argue, guys. So guys, we have come to the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed this video, please, please, please like and subscribe to this channel. Please, add your like and subscribe to this channel. And um, I think I'll see you guys in my next video. And guys, sub subscribe to my channel. My yeah. name is Janelle on, on, on YouTube. YouTube. So go to and the description link and subscribe to my channel i'm going to put the name of our youtube channel on the screen so you guys should subscribe to our channel say hi madam <laughs> hi <laughs> so subscribe and watch this video make sure you enjoy this video and eat what you're eating and enjoy this video <laughs> and this video is going to be crazy bye guys we love bye you guys.